Hi there, everybody. Good morning. Thanks for coming to join us bright and early, first day of Dreamforce. Uh, today, we're going to talk about the uh, community suite cartridge that connects Commerce Cloud and Marketing Cloud. My name is Philip Egan. I'm a product manager with Commerce Cloud, and this is Katja Franz, who's hey with our Center of Excellence. And first off, we want to make sure you're all aware and invite you uh, Wednesday to the Commerce Cloud keynote. It's right here in Moscone West on the third level at 11 AM. So look forward to seeing you all there. And this is a slide you'll be seeing a lot of over the course of this week, the forward-looking statement slide. Please remember that as you make your product or service decisions to buy things that are currently available in the market. So I'm going to tell you a little bit about Commerce Cloud. Last, last year, uh, Commerce Cloud is relatively new to the Salesforce Ohana, having uh, been demandware and then uh, joining uh, Salesforce. So some of you may not be too familiar with Commerce Cloud. We'll talk a little bit about where we're going in terms of our product. And then I'll turn it over to Katja, who's going to talk about the connector itself. So. Who is the connected shopper? The connect, today's connected shopper expects great things. They interact with brands in a multitude of ways. That could be from web to social, uh, marketplaces, even now messaging platforms like Facebook and WeChat deliver commerce, commerce experiences. And they're not just using these touch points to interact with the brand and collect information, but to actually buy right from within that particular touch point. They expect all these interactions to be great and seamless, and they expect them all to be orchestrated in a single unified experience. And Commerce Cloud is empowering brands to unify that experience across all commerce touch points. It could be from shopping and the checkout to fulfillment and customer service. The platform comes embedded with predictive intelligence, delivering great one-to-one -one personalized commerce experiences. And we also have a robust partner ecosystem ensuring satisfaction and growth from the planning and implementation of a project, to the delivery of the project, and beyond into the future. It's truly the world's number one cloud commerce platform. Again, delivering a great digital experience. We have the predictive intelligence for personalized one-to-one -one journeys. It's powered by Einstein. And not just our technology, but our partner ecosystem as well, with over 200 certified integrations right in the platform. And all this is getting delivered at massive scale. In this fiscal year alone, Commerce Cloud will power $21 billion of gross merchandise value across all of our customers combined. We power over 2,700 websites in over 50 countries. And Last year, we were doing 440 million unique shopper visits each month. And to put that into some perspective, that's more than Amazon, which does approximately 200 million unique shopper visits each, each month. In this holiday season, we're anticipating that we're going to do a half a billion unique monthly shopper visits. So massive scale through the platform as well. And this is widely recognized in the market. Some of the world's most recognizable and trusted brand, recognizable brands and trust Commerce Cloud to power their digital business. So since we became part of the Salesforce Ohana last year, a lot of our customers have been asking, where, where are you going? How are you going to be connecting the Commerce Cloud into the other clouds at Salesforce? 
And so we are addressing that right now, and that's what Katja is going to talk to talk to you about. For our customers that are really anxious to get going, we have a technology that Katja's group developed and can be used by our customers today. It's the community cloud connector, connecting commerce cloud and marketing cloud together. And then going into 2018, you're going to be hearing a lot more about a deeper integration across commerce for service and, uh, and, and commerce for, for marketing at the platform level. So we're really excited about that. But I'm going to turn it over to Katya, Thanks who will tell you about the opportunities for our customers today. All right. So Phil already shared a little bit an insight into what Commerce Cloud is. And of course, it's just really a glimpse. Uh, so Commerce Cloud is, of course, way more complex. And this slide shows you a little bit what we are talking about when we talk about Commerce Cloud. It's pretty much uh, a multi-tenant um, you know, cloud. Uh, we have a 99% uh, uptime. We have over 40 p port of deliveries worldwide. Um, we have seamless global releases, so all our customers get our new releases eight times a year, all at the same time. Uh, and on top of that, we provide really complex uh, development environments. So uh, you all know the concept of uh, production staging and development environments, and you know, all know what sandboxes are. So this is all coming with Commerce Cloud. We have open APIs based on JavaScript. Uh, so any developer can easily onboard on Commerce Cloud without ramping up to a, a proprietary environment. Uh, we have open RESTful APIs, um, debugging tools. Um, and on top of that, if you move away from the developer persona, uh, of course, we support the merchandiser, right? Uh, the uh, director of e-commerce, the merchandisers, uh, the people who set up the promotion. So our admin tool really gives uh, our customers all the tools that they need uh, to merchandise their site, to set up catalogs, products, uh, we have a very sophisticated, powerful prom promotion engine, search engine. It's coming all out of the box. And really, uh, you can use all these tools together to provide uh, a multitude of interaction points for your customers across mobile, desktop, in the store, on your phone. Yeah, and uh, oh, by the way, yeah, so we ha also have, can you go one back? Thanks. Uh, like on the C, on the green box, uh, we also have a, a huge partner network. Uh, our ISV partners. We, so we have specifically over uh, 300 ISV partners across 40 vert verticals that are heavily used across our uh, customer base. So uh, it doesn't matter if you want to um, integrate personalization, if you want to integrate uh, ratings and reviews. It's all based on open APIs, and uh, these uh, integrations are actually uh, free to use. Uh, they're available in our code repository. Customers can go and download these integrations and customize them based on their needs. So when we talk about um, the marketing cloud integration, so as Phil already started uh, indicating, so after the acquisition, we try to understand like what clouds do we really want to integrate to? What clouds do we need to integrate to? Um, and based on like what's the need in our customer base. And talking to our customers, we really understood very quickly that we needed to accelerate an integration into Marketing Cloud because there's a lot of synergy between Marketing Cloud and Commerce Cloud today. So uh, while we have two work streams where Phil's team is working on a product and platform level integration, we said, let's see how what we can do above the API with the APIs that are available today on Marketing Cloud side and on Commerce Cloud side. Uh, so we talk to our customers and uh, try to understand what are the primary use cases that we should integrate with, right? Um, and this is how we uh, basically went about this and started going um, into transactional emails uh, integration first. So Commerce Cloud does support transactional emails out of the box. Uh, but we knew like, if we would leverage Marketing Cloud, we had, we had a much more powerful tool on our hand because not just would we have uh, the transactional emails coming out of Marketing Cloud, but also we would have event tracking uh, that would lead us later uh, into Journey Builder uh, to build out the customer journey um, on Commerce Cloud and Marketing Cloud. So um, out of the box in the first release, we started looking at uh, transactional emails for account creation, password resets, uh, customer service, order confirmation, sending gift certificates, uh, all that is coming out of the box. Uh, we also sync data with Marketing Cloud, so you can go into Commerce Cloud administrative interface, you can 
schedule your data sync based on the cadence that you need, whether you want to sync five times a day or once a week. Uh, it's all just available via configuration, so you can just set this up and you're good to go. Uh, in addition to that, we started event tracking. So we just released a new version last week. We started uh, adding event tracking. So now you can send out behavioral emails out of Marketing Cloud as well. So if your customer goes into the storefront, uh, either views a page or clicks on a category, does a keyword search, all these events are being tracked, being sent to Marketing Cloud. And then you can go into Marketing Cloud and set up your customer journey accordingly. We are also looking for future reference. Uh, into an integration into our auto management system. So you can get your shipment confirmation or your pickup and store confirmation uh, directly sent out of Marketing Cloud. So since we are running short on time, um, if you want to learn more about Commerce Cloud, since this is such a really short session, uh, we have a booth here in the developer forest uh, where you can swing by. And we have actual architects there. Uh, and developers. So if you want to talk about our API specifically, or if you want to see the development environment, or anything like this, uh, you can swing by the booth and you can just talk to us. And Phil already mentioned uh, the keynote that's going to happen uh, this week as well. So uh, I highly encourage you to come by our keynote. But aside from the booth, you can also go to Trailhead, uh, search for Commerce Cloud. We have a set of trails available for you to ramp up on Commerce Cloud. and um, so you can become a Commerce Cloud trailblazer. Or you can also go to developer.salesforce.com slash Commerce Cloud if you really want to know what we are, what we do, how we work. It's all available for you to absorb online. I know there was a lot of information in a very short time. So does anyone have questions? No questions? Anyone? Go on, one question. <laughs> I want to see one question. All right. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it. Thank you.